Sanger Rainsford of New York. I fell off a boat. It's a very great pleasure and honor to welcome Mr. Sanger Rainsford, the celebrated hunter, to my home. I've read one of your books about hunting snow leopards in Tibet. I'm General Zarov. Are you Russian? Cossack. We can talk later. Now you want food, clothes and rest. You shall have them. This is a most restful spot. Follow me, Mr. Rainsford, if you please. I was about to have my dinner. We do our best to preserve the finer points of civilization here. Perhaps you were surprised that I recognized your name. You see, I read all books on hunting published in English, French and Russian. I have but one passion in my life, Mr. Rainsford, and it is the hunt. You have some wonderful heads here. That Cape Buffalo is the largest I ever saw. Oh. That fellow? Yes, he was a monster. Hurled me against a tree. Fractured my skull, but I got the brute. I've always heard the Cape Buffalo was the most dangerous of all big game. No, you are wrong, sir. The Cape Buffalo is not the most dangerous big game. Here, in my preserve, on this island, I hunt more dangerous game. You have big game on this island? The biggest. Really? Oh, it isn't here, of course, naturally. I have to stock the island. What have you imported, General? Tigers? Hunting tigers ceased to interest me some years ago. We will have some capital hunting, you and I. I shall be most glad to have your society. But what game? I'll tell you. You'll be amused, I know. I think, I may say in all modesty, that I have done a rare thing. I have invented a new sensation. May I pour you a glass of port? You see, God put two kinds on this earth. The hunters and the hunted. Me, he made a hunter. I have hunted every kind of game in every land. Grizzlies in your Rockies, crocodiles in the Ganges, rhinoceroses in Africa. I was lying in my tent one night when a terrible thought pushed its way into my mind. It had become too easy. The animal had nothing but his legs and his instinct. Instinct is no match for reason. Ah, but no animal can reason. Oh, my dear fellow, there is one that can. You can't mean. It's a game, you see. If I find my quarry within three days, he loses the game. My assistant Ivan will supply you with food and knife. I shall not follow you till dusk. I'll cheerfully acknowledge my own defeat if I do not find you by midnight of the third day. To date, I have not lost. You want a trail to follow? I'll give it one. <laughs> 